Hello everyone. It's a Saturday morning. We are kid free, so I'm able to use some of my free time uh, wisely. I've got my wife's shoe here. Very nice designer shoe, I think. And this might happen to a lot of you ladies, but stuff just gets worn out. So the contour of the shoe, the shoe itself and uh, the design of it still look pretty cool to me, but look at the bottom. Just worn out right I'm sure everyone can relate I'm gonna show you how to change that back to almost looking new or at least fool the people uh, who might be looking at your shoes like everybody does <laughs> uh, with just a simple sharpie so the key to this is I'm just using a black sharpie because I went through my marker set of actual furniture uh, markers and none of them really work to this color so I took black and I just kind of blended it in and as you can see it's doing quite a number on this boy um, all you're gonna do is be careful because it's a sharpie and it's permanent you don't want to get it on the, the leather or suede or whatever the deuce this is because um, it'll stain it but basically you're just gonna give a couple stripes then blend it in with your your finger not to push too hard not to push too soft just kind of blend it in and this is a material that will absorb it fairly quickly it's it's a rubbery type of surface so you just want to kind of roll it through and just kind of let it the material absorb the marker for you We'll put it back in fast motion. I'll show you what it looks like. But as you can see, it's looking like this to start. So get a good visual of what that looks like. Both shoes end up looking like that. The shoe itself isn't beat up, but the sole or the whatever you want to call it on the bottom is all chewed up so we're gonna fast motion and finish this up only takes like maybe five minutes or so Alright, so as you can see, finished up one shoe. You compare and tell me the difference. The thing, great thing about the Sharpie marker in this instance is that it stains it fairly well and it's pretty resistant to all water or scuffing. Um, so how long will it last? Up to you. How long do you wear them? How often do you wear them? Halfway through on this one, you can see uh, old and new. We're going to finish it up, show you the finished product. Helping wives save shoes every day. You're welcome, ladies. All right, so there we have it. Sharpie, mutilated thumb. Not really mutilated, but it looks like I was out trying to do uh, asphalt work on a Saturday morning. Shoe number one. Shoe number two. Again, remember not to uh, take the black Sharpie up onto the material as it will stain it. But you just want to put it in, blend it in with your finger. Uh, the best thing to do is not to just mark it on. You'll get this shiny, 
Looks like someone scribbled all over your shoe, look. But go back and review the tape. It's there. It was all ugly. Now it's beautiful. Go out and save yourself some pairs of shoes. I've done this with my athletic shoes all the time. So make it work.